Hi everyone. Let's talk about a special class of medications which is all the rage in kidney disease today. Patients come to me every day asking about this medication. You may have heard about it. It's called Farsega. The class of medications such as Farsega is called as SGLT2 inhibitors and it stands for sodium glucose co-transporter inhibitors that is the fancy technical name for it but medications such as farsega jardians and others are recently approved by the fda for protection of your kidneys this means that person who has certain stage of chronic kidney disease and if they can tolerate these medications the uh, studies have shown that the progression of their kidney disease slows down so their time to land on dialysis may be slowed down and yes these are very legitimate studies done and have shown significant improvement in renal function and preservation of renal function so that progress to end stage kidney disease is slowed down but not everyone who has chronic kidney disease qualifies for this medicine you have to have baseline renal function at a certain stage if you are very low sglt2 inhibitors cannot be provided to you they have not been studied safely for very advanced chronic kidney disease for example if your gfr that is one of the measures of your kidney function is above a 25 and this number remember higher this number the better it is if it is above a 25 then you do qualify for um, one of these medications and you should definitely talk with your nephrologist or your kidney doctor if they think that that might be a good addition to your kidney protective regimen once a person is on these sglt2 inhibitors however you have to be careful about certain side effects they are rare but they are present for example you may um, notice bladder infection yeast infection urinary tract infections so i usually tell my patients to drink plenty of water and go to the bathroom every 2 to 3 hours and make sure that they are squeezing out all the urine from their bladder so that there are no stagnant bacteria sitting over there SGLT2 inhibitors were first uh, invented as a uh, diabetic medication so what they do is they take glucose from your blood stream and they make it excrete in the urine so now your urine is sweet and so the bugs like to um, you know multiply there and the bacteria like the sweetness and hence there is a slight chance of you having some um, urinary tract infections but this is um, manageable in most patients and uh, it can be prevented in most patients however you should consult with a nephrologist before starting this this class of medicines and discuss if that is the right choice for you for more such information and cutting edge research about nephrology please subscribe to our channel at said simply